Hello, this is Sunday Adenuga um, on the topic how to create your own blog. This is tutorial 2, the second tutorial in this course how to create your own blog using Blogger. Welcome to the tutorial. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you some very, very important aspects of creating your blog. Now, when you remember, I told you to enter into your blog um, dashboard that is the control room or where you can manage your blog because your blog is your website or your online diary where you can post information about you, information about your business. Uh, information about your SFI business if you are into SFI or any kind of business you are into online so your blog is like your office where people can come and learn about you and know what you are doing so your blog address is your you know your domain this domain is a subdomain because it is hosted by blogger so it's going to be any name you picked dot blogspot.com that is your domain. So in the first tutorial, I, I, I talked about how to launch or start your blog. But in this tutorial, I want to teach you um, some general things about blog. So the first thing I want you to look into is this overview. Overview is the platform that makes you to know what is happening in your blog in real time in the real life. This tells you, uh, those who have commented on your blog, you know, those who have published comment on your blog, the number of people that have come to view your blog, and uh, the number of posts you have made, and um, this um, it shows you so many things. This is a place you must always go each time you go to the control panel of your blog. Uh, the control panel of your blog, you can get there by simply typing uh, www.blogger.com you know once you type blogger.com in your computer where you created your blog is going to bring you to the dashboard or to the control panel of your blog now this one tells you the post the number of posts you have made and now if you are ready to make a new post now if you are ready to make a new post you know is going to come you know as you click post all the posts you have you know you have published will come here all the posts you have published now if you want to publish another post then you can come here you know uh, to this place where, th where there is pencil once you click this place where there is pencil it's going to bring you to this place getting you ready to post a new to send a new post or to post a new article about you or about your then l let's say you want to post about you you, you can, or about your business or you want to post another topic let me go to one that I have uh, uh, posted I've, I have written before so this one that I have written before I title it what I do daily so what I do daily I, 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 I can I can bring it for everybody in the world to see I copy this that's my title I put it in post title because my SFI post this is where you put your title what I do daily then you come back to your to your write-up then you copy all the things you do daily so these are the things I do daily so you copy it and you bring it here and you paste it once you paste it it is ready for publishing so you now click on publish once you click on publish that is going to be published published and now is asking you do you want everybody you know do you want to share it on Google Plus Google Plus like I told you in the first tutorial is a social networking site created by Google so as you publish it on your blog you can also publish on Google Plus so it's good you say yes then you say you just click you publish it to the publish to the public so that everybody in the world can see it then you say share 
He wants to say share. It is not only published on your blog, it is also published on your social networking site called Google Plus. Now you can see the number of posts you have made. You have made welcome to my SFI, then you have posted what I do daily. So this is how to make posts. Every time you want to make posts, you just click post or you click you click post to see the number of posts you have made on your blog and you click this pencil to when you click it it will get you ready to post a new to send a new post to your blog so that is what we do now then your blog is a website that contains all the information about your business and so because it's your website you want to make it to have many pages pages uh, that will give them more information about you so you come to this place you see where they wrote pages then you click it now all pages will come here now you this is a new post you don't have any page for now so but you want to have pages now you you you, you, cl you click on this new page when you click on new page you want to give that your first page a title let's say you want to give it about us so you can say about us that's about us page this about us page you will have prepared what you want to be it's going to contain information about you information about your new business information about your SFI all those information you will get them now let's say you have got an information uh, you just bring this information let's say this is the information Th this is just a test I don't know the information you want to give so you want you just want to bring out this let's say this is the information you want to give about your business you copy it you bring it here you paste once you paste you click publish it is published about us page is now published on your website or blog now you can create more pages now now let's um, create a new page you create a new page this page you want to title it for instance you want to title it how how to uh, on this page what you want to do on this page is you want to teach people how to do things maybe how to register for their SFI or how to do one thing or the other on your website or you want to teach them how to do anything on the internet you want that page to teach people how to do things that's a page specially then you go to where you have put your information you must have had information you understand you put this information assuming this is your information on how to do things then you now you 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 copy all those information how to do things you copy it then you bring it here and you paste it once you paste it you click publish you keep publish so it is public that page is published that page is published if you want to create another page let's say you want to create another page and this time you want to say you want to click register you want people to register on your SFI uh, you know j uh, your SFI then you now place uh, your word you can register to earn money in SFI then here you now put your SFI gateway here your SFI gateway you can locate it from your SFI you know all you need to do is to go to your SFI um, website then you click my account then you go to my gateways click my gateways when you click my gateways your gateway is going to come it's loading now you wait for it to load you wait for it to load 
once it loads you are going to this are this is your sfi gateways you know this is your sfi gateway it's loading let's wait for it to load this is your sfi gateway so but um i love this um gateway called join my team gateway so you just highlight your gateway url you copy it once you copy it you bring it so you just place it here once you place it here this is your gateway and um but sometimes you may not want people to see this so you can you can just remove it in sfi you just say to register click here then you highlight this click here you highlight it like this you may want to make it bold now for you to link to your gateway you come to link you click link then your web address here then you now paste that your gateway join my team gateway um, URL you click it here then you click OK once you click OK then you can now publish you publish so you can see now that there, there are three pages published now these three pages that are published if you go to your website my SFI and you refresh you refresh it you are going to see that the pages does not appear the page you create will not appear until you do something what is that thing let's go back to the dashboard uh, to see what you do to, to see what you do what you do is you go to layout here you click layout then here, where you here you, you you click add a gadget so th then this add a gadget you scroll it down to pages then you click add plus so now you now click register auto about us these are the things you want to be added then you now say save these are the pages you created but it will not appear until you go to layout when you get to layout you click add you know gadget here then you click pages then you now say save arrangement once you save arrangement it is saved you go back to my sfi and if you refresh this now if you refresh this now those pages would come out you can see register is now a page how to is now a page about us is now a page now if you click register on your website now what you put on register is going to come out you see click here that we say if you click here now see what is going to happen if you click there it will take you automatically to join my team that is your sfi that i put i think you get it let's go back click back so if you click how to it's going to take you to what you put on how to see so with this blogger you have a complete website i hope you have enjoyed this training session thank you for watching come back to it if you don't understand it thank you god bless